Hey everyone, welcome back. Today I am in Jiu-Jitsu Infinite and I'm going to show you the fastest way to get spins. And this is without codes. This is just in-game getting spins regularly. If you haven't already, please like and subscribe. It's free to do so and really helps me out. Let's get straight into the video. Right, so here we are. I'm in the main game. Now, the first thing you want to do is make a private server. They are free to make, uh, especially in the paid testing at the moment. And you can let anyone join it who already has access to the game by giving them their private server code. So right here, you generate a code. There's a code, you put it in there, and then you get teleported. Now I'm already in a private server and I have been for a little bit of time. So what I can do is repeat these next steps. You go and check your missions right here. Now you check, are there any bosses alive? So I have, ooh, let's see. No, my bosses despawned. That is very sad. I was waiting so I could record killing them. But anyway, there are no bosses. Now bosses give a ton of chests and loot so you have a really high chance of getting spins from them plus the volcano deity and the rock cardinal both give legendary chests which have really high chance of giving you tons of spins in them so if there are no bosses that i can get a mission for check for your highest missions now i can do all of these missions up to the special grade which are the highest ones now at the moment in the special grade they're only a kill curse user and another kill curse user but let's say I couldn't do the special grade ones and I could only do the grade ones and below so here are all the grade one quests you got kill a band of curse users some capture points a destroy quest and a kill curse user now if you look at all of them right here and what they give the capture points only give two chests so they're pretty bad if you're going to want to farm for spins the kill a band of curse users depends on how many curse users there are and that's how many chests you can get destroy quests usually give three chests so they're not a bad bet and they're decently easy to do as well now the single kill curse users often give three chests and a common chest so that's what i'll be doing right now let me just get that quest and beat them up And here we go, I just killed him. So let's go idle transfiguration, even though I already got a ton of mastery on it. Let's check what I get. So the first chest, I got nothing. The second chest right here, I also got no spins. And the last one, I sadly also got no spins. Now this is entirely luck based what you get in your chests, but if you want to try and increase the amount of chests you get and what you get in the chests go and do the highest quests you can so i'll be doing a special grade one and see what i get from that well that was easy let's check what we got from the chests right here first chest a legendary already i got a sukuna finger now that could have been five in eight spins right there here I got two and eight spins. Oh, what what are these gonna be? Now I've got no more spins from them, but that could have been another five cursed spins. Or five in eight spins, sorry. Oh ho, here are the bosses. So, let's start off with the one that is not here. Why is the room guardian not here? That's strange. Anyway, let's kill the volcanic deity. Volcanic deity down. Let's check what we get from the chests. Two legendaries in one chest. And how did we get zero spins from that? Another legendary. There's five in eight spins. And it's already just our second chest. That's our third, and nothing from that. 
Ooh, another legendary. Oh, it's a refund point, the worst that I could have gotten. Then our last chest from the Volcanic Deity. Two and eight spins right there. So that's seven spins from the Volcanic Deity that I got. Now let's quickly do the Rock Cardinal. Yes, a Domain Clash. Yes, I won! So that's guaranteed death of the rock cut. Right, now let's detonate. There we go got a ton of mastery now from these chests the first one gave us zilch second one nada the third one ooh, a legendary a sakura fourth is nothing two legendaries five spins and a sakuna finger now that's actually really worth it the next one gave us nothing at all and the last legendary one will give what legendary a refund point now from the rock cardinal i got five spins this may take you a little while to grind out some spins but it is still the fastest way there is if you enjoyed or found this video helpful please like subscribe and hit the notification bell to get notified when i make a new video thanks for watching and see you all next time